have seen how the northern mountains form the crown of India. As we come lower down the Himalayas, we find a vast and fertile land called the Northern Plains, also known as the indo gangetic Plains or the North Indian River Plains. The Northern Plains are located between the Himalayas in the north and the southern peninsula. The abundant water and rich silt brought down by the Himalayan rivers Ganga, Yamuna, Indus, Brahmaputra and their tributaries make the northern plains very fertile. The indo gangetic plains are flat and even stretching up to 2400 kilometers from west to east and with a width of 260 kilometers to about 350 kilometers. The northern plains can be divided into two river basins, the Indus Basin in the west and the Ganga Brahmaputra Basin in the east. The Indus River Basin in the west a major part of the Indus River Basin lies in Pakistan. It has five tributaries Satluj, Ravi, Bias, Chenab, and Jhelum, two of which, Satluj and Bias, flow through the northern plains before joining the Indus in Pakistan. The Ganga Brahmaputra Basin in the east. The Ganga Basin and the Brahmaputra Basin constitute the bigger part of the northern plains. The Ganga Basin. The river Ganga is considered very sacred by Hindus. It originates high up in the Himalayas in the glacier called Gangotri. The Ganga flows vibrantly through Uttarakhand, Uttar Pradesh, Bihar and West Bengal thus forming the Ganga Basin. The Bhagirathi, Mandakini and Alaknanda rivers along with smaller streams join the Ganga on its downward journey before it reaches the flat northern plains. Its tributaries like the Gandak Khagar, Gomti, Kosi and Son are always water-fed by the melting snow of the Himalayas. The Ganga Basin has rich and fertile soil. This is also the reason why the northern plains are perfect for agriculture. Its major crops include rice, wheat, jute and sugarcane. The Ganga Basin is therefore thickly populated. Important cities located in the Ganga Basin include Delhi, Agra, Kanpur, Allahabad, Patna and Kolkata. The sacred cities Haridwar, Ayodhya and Varanasi are also located in the Ganga Basin. The Yamuna River, also a Ganga tributary, waters the northern plains and joins the Ganga at Allahabad. The place where these rivers meet is called the Sangam. Thousands of pilgrims gather here once every 12 years to celebrate the Kumbh Mela. The Ganga flows down through the northern plains finally entering West Bengal. Here it breaks up into two branches, Hooghly which passes through West Bengal while the other part is called Padma which flows into Bangladesh. Here the Padma joins Brahmaputra before entering the Bay of Bengal. 
the Brahmaputra Basin. The Brahmaputra originates in Tibet where it is known as the Tsangpo. The river flows eastwards and enters India through Arunachal Pradesh. Next, it passes through Assam and then moves into Bangladesh. The Garo, Khasi and the Naga hills surround the Brahmaputra Basin. The Brahmaputra receives abundant water by way of the heavy rainfall in the northeast. The river often overflows during the monsoon season causing floods which damage and destroy life and property. Occupation of people living in the northern plains We have seen how agriculture is the main occupation of people living in the northern plains. The northern plains being a very fertile region produce crops such as wheat, rice, pulses, jute, cotton, sugarcane and oil seeds. Farmers in the northern plains actively use modern irrigation methods. Rice being the major crop grown in the northern plains, they are often called the rice bowl of India.